Hello, everybody. Uh, I would like to express my sincere thanks for giving me this opportunity to present my project titled with developing training course to promote staff members' academic leadership competency. Here is Ahmed Abdul Latif. This project supervised by the Professor Sana Radi. This project has three outcomes. The first is preparing material for leadership competency course. The second is conducting training on leadership competency to the selected faculties. The third one is disseminating the leadership competency course. This project has four phases. The first phase has two outcomes. The first is building competent team. The second is conducting training needs assessment to this priority, to list the priority of the leadership competency. The second phase has two uh, outcomes also. The first is preparing leadership competency course to increase the job satisfaction of faculties. And the second is evaluating the course of, uh, of leadership uh, competency. Uh, the third phase also contains two outcomes, conducting training on leadership competency to selected faculties. But the, the second one is the conducting training to other uh, groups or other faculties in the faculty. The fourth, phase also contain two outcomes. The first is applying leadership competency course in other programs. And finally, a disseminating leadership competency course in international journal or book, uh, aiming at sharing the experience. There are a list of uh, stakeholders can be summarized in faculty council, curriculum committee, uh, famer fellows, selected faculty lectures, administrators, and team members, and finally, quality unit members. There are shining spots. The, the first one is my uh, Some faculties are enthusiastic, but not all. The second, my department is not so large, around 14 members. And the last one is the faculty was accredited. Also has internal quality system. However, there are many shining spots. There are some challenges. Uh, moving from my previous uh, job in Kinga, at King Abdulaziz University, to my home country or for my home faculty, uh, many university. Frankly, there are a big difference between the facility, resources, availability of the team. And this is a big challenge for me. And the publication takes long time and effort. This project, the main objective of this project is preparing training material uh, of the leadership competency. And this project has 10 activities and these activities can be summarized as preparing the present plan to my faculty, IRB approval, building training team, conducting training needs assessment, analysis of the training needs assessment. All of these activities has been done starting from January 2022 to uh, till July. And after that, preparing leadership competency course, evaluating leadership competency course will is running in nowadays. And after finishing the preparing of the material, Will, uh, will conduct uh, training sessions for selected groups. After finishing, they collect the feedback and surveys and uh, uh, some behaviors from the faculty members. And after that, preparing the uh, poster, I hope I will present my poster and my results in next January, inshallah. There are little bit changes made during this project. The construction of the project team was not achieved in the planned time. Thus, another members from the other department have been invited. Frankly, I, I gained many experience during this project, starting implementation of lifelong learning, problem solving, designing and implementing plan B, managing of unexpected challenges, gaining knowledge and leadership skills. And finally, I wish to thank you for your attention.